Hi everybody, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2021 Gold Rush autographed uh, full-size football helmets specialty edition. We're doing four boxes. This is random team break number two. 32 spots, everyone gets a team of the NFL. Some Brady's in there, Mahomes is in there. We'll see what happens. It says four boxes per case, but they were they were shipped to us loose like this. So FYI, big thanks to all of these lovely people here for getting into the action. I appreciate it. Thanks to Will for closing that out. All 32 teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. A full 12 times, six and a six. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final, or six, and six more. Seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12th and final time. After 12, we got Will down to Will. Got the, got the golf on in the background. There's 12 times right here for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12th and final time. We got the Saints down to the Browns. Now, as you know, with products like this, there's no real full checklist, just sell sheet type stuff. So just keep that in mind as you consider trades. Will with the Saints, Brian with the Eagles, Gary with the Chargers, Will with the Patriots, George with the Steelers, Raymond with the Niners, Josh with the Cowboys, Will with the Falcons, uh, Angel with the Bills, Steve Locke with the Panthers, Will with the Texans, Josh with the Rams, Steve with the Colts, Will with the Dolphins, Karen with the Bucks, Joe with the Chiefs, Will with the Bengals, Shane with the Lions, Josh with the Broncos, Brian with the Seahawks, Will with the Bears, Casey with the Ravens, Shane with the Jags, Will with the Vikings, Garrett with the Packers, Will with the Cardinals and my Raiders, Milton with the Jets, Bradley with the Titans, Michael with the Giants, Kyle with the Washington football team, and last but not least, Will, last spot mojo. Cleveland Browns. All right, let's get all this on one page. Let's sort by column B. All right, so I'm going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, and then the break. I'm trying to think. There may be a possibility that there there will be um, a college helmet in there. Maybe I don't know, but in the event that there's a college football helmet pulled, we'll go, usually we'll go by our. Uh, it's in the frequently asked questions area. We'll go by our non checklist, no pro uniform rule, right? Which means that uh, if we pull a college helmet, it'll go to the team that they are currently on if they're active, or the team they played for the longest, according to ProFootballReference.com. By season first, then we'll we'll use tiebreakers if if necessary. But yeah, we'll go by that rule, no checklist. All right. So with that, we're gonna pause the video. When we come back, we'll see if there's any trades, and then the break. All right. Welcome back, folks. No trades. We're done. That's okay. We're, we're gonna get into our first round of who am I? All right, so let's pop this baby open. We have the name of the player on here somewhere. All right, C Dub Super Entertainment. Thanks, Chris. Am I be able to tell? Aha, uh -huh, there it is. Okay, who am I? I'm retired. A retired football player. Um, let's see. I was a second round draft pick back in 1996. Played for one team my entire career from 96 to 2007. A Super Bowl champion. 
a six-time Pro Bowler, a three-time first-team All-Pro, part of this team's Ring of Honor. I was a consensus All-Big Ten player. Um, I have, uh, I'm a fullback, might give it away, 5,088 rushing yards and 58 rushing touchdowns. Went to Purdue. Who am I? Yeah, I was, I was pretty good. What am I doing these days? I guess my, my son, Griffin, is the backup quarterback at Western Michigan University after spending the 2017 season at Purdue. Who am I? Any guesses? Second round fullback back in 1996. One team his entire career and a Super Bowl champion. I wonder if he, if, if he kind of maybe paved the way for the, the modern fullback these days. Oh, fullback went out of fashion. And I came, kind of came back into fashion. And Belichick uses the fullback a lot. I know John Gruden loves using the fullback a lot. There you go. Sean Mandel's got it. Mike Allstott is right. Let's see if we can pull this helmet out of here. There it is. So specialty helmet. So you got that cool matte black finish, the Bucks logo right there. Where is his autograph? There, ooh, that's, there it is. Using some red ink. There's Mike Allstott's autograph. Nice. You got the Bucks logo on the front. You can see on my face cam right there. The Buccaneers on the back. The, uh, the Beckett sticker. The Beckett card is right there too. That's pretty sweet. What do we got here? We got, we got this attached to it as well. Another certificate of authenticity card right there. So the helmet itself really cool. The autograph really cool as well. Nice. Uh, and that, I, that is Karen Steele and the Buccaneers. All right, thanks, Karen. Appreciate it. Helmet. I'm glad I mentioned the college rule because I got a college helmet here. All right, who am I? I'm an active quarterback in the NFL. 6'4", 218 pounds, 12 touchdowns, 14 interceptions in my career, 2,804 passing yards. Have not really made my mark in the NFL yet, but I was a first round pick. And I'm currently with a different team right now, not the team that drafted me. Yeah, there you go, Sean. Yep. 
Yeah, it looked like a Buckeye helmet. It was. It was Dwayne Haskins' Buckeye helmet. These helmets look really cool. So another helmet with that matte black finish. There's Dwayne Haskins' autograph right there. You got some, this is really cool. You got some Buckeye stickers right there as well, which I think is pretty awesome. You got the Beckett sticker right back there too. Pretty sweet. So Pittsburgh, that's George Foster who has the Pittsburgh Steelers. Well, maybe Haskins can revive his uh, revive his career in Pittsburgh. Let me marinate behind uh, Ben Roethlisberger. Yeah, I hope so too, Sean. If he marinates, be marinates behind Ben Roethlisberger, learns a little bit for the next year or two. I think, I want to say that when uh, when he was drafted, everyone always said that Haskins was always going to be a work in progress. Like he was not like a he was not like a week a, a season one quarterback. He would need more seasoning. I want to say that they, they even said that they even said that uh, that he was supposed to kind of redshirt his first year, though. You know what I mean? Uh, maybe maybe a change of scenery will do him well as well. All right, next helmet. Good luck. Helmet too. Uh, these special helmets are really cool. All right, who am I? I'm another quarterback. Another active quarterback. And another first round quarterback. Still with the same team. I've got 35 touchdowns to 22 interceptions. 5,970 career passing yards, pass rating of 84.1, 702 rushing yards, and a few rushing touchdowns as well. If I, I feel like if I say his college, I'm going to give it away. But I went to Duke. First round pick, first round quarterback out of Duke. Not too many Duke quarterbacks out there. This year could be a big year for this player. He's got more than 5,000 career passing yards, and he did not go to Duke. There you go. CW, Katie, Snowboard Kid, and now Steve Birch has it too. It's Daniel Jones. Could be a big year for him. Got a healthy Saquon Barkley on that team. Ooh, this looks really cool. Look at that blue ink on that matte black. That looks really nice. You got the uh, Beckett sticker on the back and the corresponding card. Very nice, that goes to Michael P. 
and the New York Football Giants. Yeah, the blue ink looks great, doesn't it? Right against that matte black. And he's got some good penmanship. Again, big year. Could be a big year for him. I would even argue could buy low on Daniel Jones. Oh, yeah, these specialty helmets are a lot of fun. All right, last one coming up. I think we've got some jerseys up on the site too. We got Hit Parade, we got Gold Rush, we got all sorts of fun stuff like this. That's a can add a little something different to your collection. Let's get that box tag. All right. Final box. I think this I think these players are a bust. Well, Daniel Jones, a lot of upside with Daniel Jones. Mike Allstott's a legend. Dwayne Haskins might be the only, but he's got, he, there's a possible ceiling there too. I think he's been pretty solid. All right, last one here. Oh, this is cool too. Nice, all right. Retired running back. Um, played for three teams my entire career. Was a late first round pick out of East Carolina. Was 5'11", 203 pounds. Big dude, big running back. Was an offensive player of the year, a first team all pro, made the 2000 yard club, a three time pro bowler, was an NFL rushing yards leader. Ended my career with 9,651 rushing yards, 55 rushing touchdowns, 307 redemption, uh, redemptions, receptions for 2,255 receiving yards and nine receiving touchdowns, not bad. He was pretty, there was a good chunk of time. He was, he was, he was a beast. Finished my career, my last two seasons, with the Arizona Football Cardinals. Played with the Jets for a season, but everyone knows him. Yeah, snowboard kid. Yep. RJF, Sanford, all remember him as a Tennessee Titan. Chris Johnson. Nice. Another black helmet with the blue. Nice. So there's the Titans logo right there. That looks pretty cool. And you got you got an inscription right here too, talking about his 2,000 yard season. That's pretty sweet. Yeah. I, I forgot how I mean five eleven is kind of tall for a for a running back five eleven two oh three Tennessee Titans that'll be for Bradley Bradley with the Titans and there you go ladies and gentlemen that was four boxes of a uh, Gold Rush autograph full size helmets a lot of fun keep your eye out on jazbeescasebreaks.com for more and I'll see you next time for the next one bye bye.